28,000 elevators in North Carolina, and this face is on every single one of them. That's Sherry Berry, the popular commissioner of labor. We'll soon see a different face on the elevator certificates. Berry says she will not run for re-election next year. My job that I love, the people I work with that I love, I just don't feel like I can ever say goodbye to them, you know, so I just have to leave. So I'm leaving while I'm in love. There she is talking about her time in office, referencing Rita Coolidge's song, I'd Rather Leave While I'm In Love. WFM News 2's Laura Brace took an elevator ride with Barry to talk about her final ride. A career filled with more ups than downs. It's just been fun. I don't know how else to explain it. After five four-year terms, Sheree Barry, the elevator queen, is enjoying her final ride. Somebody new needs to experience this. Commissioner Barry gained a cult following after the Department of Labor decided to include her photo on every elevator inspection certificate in the state. It's been just the most wonderful experience to be able to relate to people in North Carolina in that personal, fun kind of way. From song. Charity accounts and even brews. Hopefully, I'm going to have a beer soon in Charlotte. Yay. No way! There's no doubt North Carolina's iconic elevator lady plays an important role in our state's identity. Her pro tip for whoever takes her place. And they better get a name that rhymes. <laughs> oh, I also asked her for her elevator pitch. I would say, hey, look at here. I'm responsible for your safety on this elevator, so don't do anything in this elevator you don't want your mama to know about. Because <laughs> I'm I watching. Love you. I'm watching. <laughs> oh, wow. I will miss her, even though I don't know her. Right, it's just so familiar. You often see her. Right. Well, in retirement, Barry says she's most looking forward to spending more time with her grandkids and great grandkids. We have some behind the scenes clips with Commissioner Barry on our website, WFMYNews2.com.